Bush uh, Baron Miguel to Kuna and Sonny Rao to the awards for decision for Dominic Benerji and a season. And the battle continues. Well, referee Vic Worley bringing it up. It's nice to see a referee take command, especially in a tag team match like that. Quite a bit of uh, shenanigans going on right now, though. Looks like we're having another match. Nevertheless, it'll go on a record look at the victory for S.D. Jones and Dominic Pinochet.
on a special interview recorded earlier on with Rick Raw, Rick McGraw. Okay, you people, you need anything for your cars from polished to rebuilt engines. You go to RS or Strauss, the complete automotive. Pardon, not just as the Intercontinental Champion, but as the number one contender for the World Rusting Federation Championship, beating Bob Backlund on the 24th of August. Have you ever seen 248 pounds of style and grace float down the face of a 12-foot wave, bank off the top, come through the lip, bounce off the white water into the tube, and get spit out between the coral heads? I know in the water that I can rip, but in the mat, in the ring, even a world champion, even the greatest wrestler in the world, the title holder is no match for the Magnificent One. There's no competition. I will out-wrestle you. I don't have to brawl you. I don't have to kick you. I can out-wrestle you. With us now, ladies and gentlemen, Rick McGraw. Rick, uh, I'm sure that it goes without saying that the fans in the World Wrestling Federation are really, really sorry for your condition, the broken neck. And we just wish you uh, the best of everything. Do you think you'll be able to come back so? Uh, yes, I've talked to the doctors, and they said it's going to be, well, maybe not soon, but I will be back. Uh, I'll be back stronger. But uh, Vince, this guy, Killer Khan, he's just getting out of control. He's broken Andre's ankle. Uh, he's just devastating the whole area. Uh, where's it going to stop? Uh, um, this kind of thing shouldn't happen. Uh, I mean, I'm out there trying to wrestle. Uh, you know, I promised my fans that I would, I would never turn on them. Uh, you know, even now, uh, as much as, uh, hate as I feel in my heart for a man who would do something like this, you know, take away my livelihood. You know, my ability to uh, make money and uh, feed my family. You know, uh, what kind of, what kind of animal has Freddie Black Blassie created? Uh, where will it end? Lastly, I'm sure, but would not like for it to, to end soon. Killer Khan is on a rampage. Andre's looking for him. You're going to be looking for him. God willing that your neck heals properly and, uh, and get back in the squared circle. He, he is, without a doubt, one of the most sadistic individuals uh, in the World Rusting Federation ever, I, su I suppose, uh, Rick. But you're going to have to deal with him. Well, you know, Killer Khan, he's, uh, he's so ugly, but... He gets on there and he talks, and we, we may not understand it, but he does want to speak, he does want to speak, speak one English very well, and that English is wrestling. Killer Khan does know how to wrestle. He was in trouble. Uh, I had him going. Uh, I had him beat, uh, and and he injured me like he did. Uh, Killer Khan can't wrestle. I can't say that for him. We wish you the best of luck, Rick. We hope you come back to the square circle real soon. Thank you very much.